Okay, so by the look of it, it seems to like it, it's gonna be almost entirely down to keeping Kevin alive as usual. But I have the timing down on his jump attack, which is a good thing. Because that's one of the harder attacks to avoid. Unfortunately, I just gotta remember that he, for whatever reason, he seems to be able to hit both on the E descent, but also the ascent. Which makes no sense, but okay, whatever. Actually, no, maybe it makes a little bit of sense. There are some horns on the bottom of him that, like, could be reasoned that them going upward is damaging. I don't know. Three, two, one. Seriously. Thanks, Kevin. I almost want to rinse this, but I'll play it out. Tick, tick, tick. Okay. Charlotte, claw me. Great. Okay, fine. Spell magical effects, pretend that never happened. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to tick this down. He's going to get it off. Holy shit. I'll take it. Okay, so this attack, if I remember correctly, locks you in place if it hits. So don't get hit by it. <laughs> we got stuck in the wall! I might have to grind again. Yep. One more attempt at the boss, if a- if this fumbles, then I'll just spend the remaining screen time grinding. Okay, he's using Lucent Beam, so... Reese, buff me, please. Okay, never mind. A final losing Charlotte. It sucks, but I still have means of healing. Can these blow up, please? Thank you. And just in case. Oh, of course, the saber has just run out. Ugh, I'm gonna need to revive someone, and honestly, she's a fountain of health. Damn it. Get over here. Tunk, tunk, tunk. Nope! Whew. Let me guess, if I do one more? Three, two, one. Seriously? Kevin, seriously? I'm not made of heels. Oh my god, it's Kevin. I'm not made of HP, Kevin. Oh, good. There goes my last cup. Okay, fine. Fine game. I get it. I get it. I get it. Grinding. Eat a cookie, and...
start chewing enemies. Probably 55 might be a good point. He's dead. Okay, to capitalize on the XP gain, I need to kill enemies fast and kill enemies that take damage. Tall order in some cases. But it's still doable. Additionally, class strikes. And of course, I can't get down from here, so I gotta go the long way. Uh, that way. Hey game, you know what would be really nice? If I can get an XP multiplier on a large fight. Pretty sure that's not gonna happen, but I would love it. So say if I were to go up here, and maybe for these guys... Please game? Of course not. Thank you, Reese. Of course, for those two I get it. I mean, I guess I shouldn't be too picky. At least I'm getting XP. Even still. Good, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Two more of those, please. Actually, grinding off these two sets of enemies right here is really worthwhile. Hmm. This is a very fast grind. Now, if only I could stop using Phenomenal Fist and actually use Spin Because it's the attack that actually covers area. Spin Kick? I gotta remember this place then, because this is a really good place to grind. Of course, you target that enemy. But hey, that's three of four. You know what? Whee! Okay, 55. Let's at least get Reese up to that point. And if I'd probably grind up a little more uh, SC. That's bad. Back up. Okay. That's one. Uh, hitbox? What was with that hitbox? Okay. Kevin and Reese at 55. That should be okay for now. So let's see here. You get attack saber too, which good. They'll make your saber spells a little more powerful for most of the other bosses. And meanwhile... You'll at least get the extra stamina. You can't really benefit from much else, can you? I guess trek down spirit. And let's see here. Remove that. Or Sabres 2. You're gonna learn to love the hitboxes. Yeah, I'm already loving them. I started loving them from the moment I was introduced to Zenoa. And not even on No Future. Box Standard Hard Mode Zenoa. I feel that says a lot. Alright, let's see how this is gonna work. Three, two, one. Not 
slightly better damage. He's already started using Lucian for you. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. One. How did I know he was going to do that? Two, one. Nope. Try again, Noodle. Two, three, four. You gotta be kidding me. Really? But this is at least a much better run. Just in case, reset the buffs. Or debuffs. That's good damage. Seriously? Okay. Three, two, one. Resetting. Seriously, he sat on top of me. This is what he do. He sit on you. Oh, for the love of crap. Can we pretend that run never happened? Just yeet it into the sun. I'll even give you the keys to the trash barge. Like, holy crap. You done, Reese? Because I need you to throw out debuffs quick. Just in case. Tap one of these out. Tap one more. Three, two, one. As bad as it sounds, provided Light Gazer attacks my party members, I think I'll be fine. Three, two, one. Nope, not chancing it. Two, one. Good. Just 
just in case, reset buff. This is perfect. Charlotte, be dear. There we go. Good nuke. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. That's really good damage. Yeah, and I jinxed it. Of course. Wait, how have I only used one cup right now? That's how. Huh. Okay, now he's gonna start spamming his eye beam. If I remember correctly, he does like three of these rapids. No, he does not. Five rapid. And we're getting into the hard part of this. Reese, get that off of you. Meanwhile, Charlotte, get that on me. He's gonna jump. That's right, keep using your eye beam. Nope. You're gonna do I beam again. Just in case. One more. Two, three. Let's try a spin kick. Because this will give me enough invincibility to shoot through the shackles and not worry about it. Beam two. You know what's styling on this guy? Do I get credit for that? 
Do I get credit for missing and still hitting? <laughs> okay, decent pro- that's pretty good progress for today. Actually, no, you don't need that. We've got half of the Bedevadons down. And we've officially gone four hours of this stream. Yeah, agreed. What the hell are these hitboxes? Wonky Dick is having a field day over this game now. Just- what? Uh. Save one. Check the shop, because I think there are some more equipment. But while I'm doing that... To everyone who's dropped by so far, I, uh, might not be able to remember every single one of your names, but even still, I really do genuinely appreciate any and all support I get with these streams. It... It's nice doing something like this, just to unwind, chat with people, have a nice time myself, and potentially give a nice time to other people, too. Tune in next week, Saturday, Saturdays, from 9am Eastern Standard to noon. Usually it's for random games. I end up playing whatever I feel like it, but if I'm giving, if I'm given a suggestion of something to play, such as, well, say something free, for an example, or just generally a game period. I'll look into it. It's not necessarily a guarantee, but again, if it's free, that's especially going to be higher on the menu. Bear in mind though, I do a lot of research. I like researching things. So if something looks a little suspect, then maybe that's why it doesn't show up. Otherwise, tune in Sundays, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard to 10, for, for dedicated game clearing. Currently, Trials of Mana, no future. If you happen to like all the nonsense that I go through, slash for that, don't worry. These VODs stay up on Twitch for a couple weeks, then get ported off to a YouTube channel, Sage Blake, where things get truncated down into approximately 15 to 45 minute segments to make it easier to watch, plus some additional commentary in places. You can also find that I've been doing a running series known as Sage After. The first Saturday stream of every month is usually Sage After Live, where I'm, dedica where I'm dedicating some time to looking at the entries of the Expo of the, the Sonic and Amateur Games Expo of the last year, in this case 2021. But otherwise, a weekly video goes up on that YouTube channel under again uh, as the series Sage After. If you want to chat with me for any reason, maybe play a game or two, if I have the time, then that's fine. You can usually find me through Twitter or Discord by the tag Sage of Magi. On the, on the second of those, I'm on various Discords for indie games such as Havoc Fox and Shield Cat. I'm also part of the SFGHQ Discord as well, and lastly... I'm also on the Discords of a few different streamers, including Mega Wolf. Because, uh, honestly, he's a bit of an idol of mine. <laughs> Anything I draw or write in my spare time usually gets put up on a DeviantArt page. Sage of Magi, one more time on that one. And as a final item, I'm currently in the process of making a card game. If it's not too much of your time, feel free to take a look at it. It's a free mod for Tabletop Simulator. The running name? Rekens Memoria, or Project Rima. Think of it like Yu-Gi-Oh! the roguelike. Trials of mana. But with all things settled and done, I think it's about time I return to my void. Everyone again, thank you so much for dropping by. Thank you so much for spending some time here. And I hope you all have a nice night. Stay safe. Then again, Thalaki, ne? Right?